So, okay, we've echoed the string position. We don't need to do that anymore, but we still need to keep this offset here in order for us to, uh, our program to work correctly. But we don't need the line break on the end. So, now what we need to do in here is we need to use the substring replace function to replace um, from a certain uh, part of this. So, we need to create a new variable, or well, we don't actually, we need to update the text variable using the dollar, not the pound sign. Substring replace, remember we're searching for the string, and this is equal to text. We're searching in the text. Substring replace inside the text. What we're looking for is replace. We're looking for the word replace. Uh, what well, we're not looking for the word replace, but we're looking for what the user specified to replace. Now we need the start and the length. So where are we starting at? Obviously, we're starting at the offset. Uh, no, sorry, we're starting at the string position. And the length um, is the length of the search character. So we're starting at the string position that's been be that we've been found, and we're ending three characters later. For example, if it was cat. So now let's check this works. So we'll come down here after this while loop, and we'll echo out text. So let's give this a try. The cat sat on the mat. We want to search for cat, and we want to replace it with monkey. So I'm going to click find and replace. The monkey sat on the mat, so it works. Now we're going to type the cat sat on the cat. Search for cat and replace with monkey. Find and replace, you can see it's updated both.